Tell me about yourself. Hi, sir. I'm Swati, mm -hmm. and I have been working in Tech Mahindra from last four years as mm -hmm. a technical support analyst. Okay. And right now, as my interest has moved to the testing field, I'm just trying to learn on the manual testing and things. Okay, I think you have earlier you have worked as a technical support role, right? Yeah. I think you are deal with different set of uh, issues, or technical issues. Yeah, sir. I think you written. I have seen that Citrix, VPN, VDA, right? Uh, yes. Okay. Uh, in the server, uh, did you see any applications? Did you install any applications in VPN or? Uh, no, sir. Only with the Citrix will be working. Like we'll be helping the users with like how to connect uh, to the Citrix. Okay, I think you are going to provide the username password. Yes. Or yes. reset it, all those things. Yeah, just process. in the settings will be there. So. Like how to connect to the VPN. Like how, what are the options that we have to choose in the settings. What type of escalations matrix you try to follow in your project? Uh, escalation, sir. So we are not supposed to do any P1 or the P2. And we will be having access for the P3 and the P4. These are nothing but the priority. Mm -hmm. If the issue is with the user, if they are not able to access a particular application and they are getting any login issue. So in that time, they will be contacting us and we will be supporting like what is the exact issue. Like if they are getting any error message, like if there is any password related issue, so we'll be having their da their data mm -hmm. and we'll check on like what is the exact reason, either the account got blocked or else uh, is there any issue with that particular password or else they have changed multiple times. Mm -hmm. So on that basis, we'll be just letting know. Okay. Did you install anything through the? Uh, yes, yeah, sir. With the help of the SSM applications, so we used to uh, like install few applications like uh, Cerner Bridge. It is one of the application which is there uh, inside the VDI. If user want to access that. Firstly, we'll be providing the request. The request, so the user have to place that request. Once the request is approved by the particular manager, mm -hmm. so after approving, we'll be just helping them in like installing the application from this year. Okay. After all these things, right? What are the platform that you are going to use? All this connect with the uh, to your people. I'm just like I have the problem. I'll raise it. Uh, I'll raise a ticket. Uh, mm -hmm. You try to connect to the people, right? Uh, so yes. what are the platform that you are going to prefer? Remote access. Sir. The remote access. So we'll be okay. having an asset tag. Okay. Asset tag. So based on that asset tag, we'll be taking that asset tag and the, in the remote session, the remote control access. So we can enter the asset tag number. So where we can be directly getting the user screen that will be visible. So why you are coming into IT then? Uh, so it's been four years so that I have been working in the technical. Mm -hmm. So I just want to like upskill. So even that is also IT, but I just want to be in the complete IT field. So where in the technical, I have been like the rotational shifts and I felt there is not that much growth. So it looks like a routine work for me, sir. Good. Why choosing in testing only then? Like I'm sure that uh, like completely being in the developer side, I can't do that much. And I feel that I can give my 100% to the testing, sir. Okay. Coming to the testing topics and uh, how good are in manual process? Yeah, sir. Like uh, on the topics, I'm like, sir, not I can say like uh, for 100, I can give myself like 95 to 97. Upon sir. 10? Upon 10, I can give uh, 9, sir. Okay. So uh, tell me what a different we mean a defer defect and reject a defect. Uh, defer means uh, the developer will be placing that on the whole. Mm -hmm. Rejected means if, for example, the developer has given us an, uh, 10 pages of code and mm -hmm. if we are doing the 11th page, mm -hmm. so and we are sending that as an a defect. So in that case, the developer will be rejecting that. Okay. And uh, what is the full form of uh, SDLC? Software development life cycle. Sir. What is the need of creating or doing SDLC? Uh, uh, for an application. So we'll be getting the requirements from the user. Mm -hmm. So where all the uh, like all the team members like the QA, the developer, the stakeholders, the PA and everyone will be involved into that. So where the client has given us a requirement based on that requirements in the SDLC we will be trying to like perform that application as per the user needs. Okay. Now let's take what are the difference between test designing and system designing? Test design, we will be getting that in the STLC sir, software mm -hmm. testing life cycle. Will it, uh, it is one of the phase in the STLC. So here we will be like uh, based on the requirements, the user requirements, we will be uh, writing the test cases and the test scenarios. Okay. In the uh, system testing, uh, sorry, in the test uh, system designing, uh, so the developer will be like uh, creating the architecture, mm -hmm. ar architecture as per the application like uh, application in the sense uh, like the user requirements like how the user is looking to get that particular application to look like on mm -hmm. that basis he will be like creating the things okay good so uh, what are the purpose of going for etu testing etu testing purpose 
E to E testing from the starting node to the ending node we'll be doing. So it is not uh, like application. So here the QA team will be checking the application from the starting node to the end node, sir. Okay. Uh, end node uh, where not only the starting to the ending but from the front and the back end also. Okay. Uh, you are good on the communications. You are good on this uh, project level information also. And uh, be good on uh, manual concepts. I think you are good onto it. And please try to practice more on automation. So that uh, you'll be in good shape when you are complete the testing tools. That is the only feedback that I can provide from my center. Okay. Thank you, sir. You're welcome. Thank you, sir.